In this video, we will see the steps to find a user exit. So let us see the agenda for this session. First, we will see the steps to find a user exit itself. So when we have found our user exit, we will validate it. So let us see how to find it. So first we have to go to VL01 transaction code to pick a sales order for delivery and then we have to click on system and then we have to click on status itself. And when that is done, we will get a particular screen here that is this one. So here we are mentioning our program name. We have to double click on it that is SAP MV50A. So in this case it is this one. So then our under screen would be coming up and then we have to select the binoculars button and we have to put the string as user exit. So here we are putting our string as user exit. So make sure we are checked the radio button in main program and just press enter. After pressing enter, we will get this particular screen. Here we are getting multiple function modules. We have to select the function module which suits better for us. So once we have found out our user exit, now we have to validate it. For that we have put a breakpoint and test whether it is okay or not. So for that now we are going to VL02 transaction code and we are giving a particular delivery number. Suppose this is the delivery number and we have to press enter and change a particular value and click on save. After doing that our breakpoint would be triggered. So if it is triggered we, we can say our user exit is validated. If it is not triggered we can say our user exit is not validated. So now let us see all these things practically. So we have a business requirement here that is in VL01 that is create delivery order. The standard program does not check for the storage location equals to none when the user clicks on the save button. So we have to implement our user exit here that we have to first find out the user exit and then we have to put an enhancement on the user exit. So in this session we will be just finding the user exit on the function module so we have the technical requirements here so storage location field is LGOT and it is available in LIPS table so now let's go into VL02 transaction code and let's search for an exit user exit so this is it now click on system and go to status So here we are getting a program screen which is this one if I just double click on it now here a program is written so I will search for a user exit and I will search it here now I have to find which is my user exit which is my function module which I can use as my user exit so we have to check for a save user exit So we have to estimate it roughly here which user exit would be helpful for us for our requirement. So here when we are saving our document we have to check for this user exit and I hope this is the one form user exit save document prepare. So here we will put a debugger and when we are saving our document at that time if this particular debugger is triggered that means this is the user exit we have to apply so let's go back I have put a debugger there and now let's just run this so here if I just save and if that debugger triggers that means that is the function module that is the user exit that we were searching for and I have saved it and here we go so here our debugger stopped that means this is the this is the user exit that we were searching for so our scenario was completed here so I hope you have understood how to search for a user exit